wearing jewelry. Hold on a second. Hold on. I look way better with jewelry on. Give me a half a second. Give me, let me get my studs in. A stud for a switch. <laughs> if you know, you know. I can put my chain on. Hold on. Ah. That's better. Welcome to another bathroom products video. You thought I tested everything that could possibly go into a bathroom? False. I haven't because people just keep making things for me and I'm gonna keep testing them. So I got a few products here. Um, it currently smells like dog poop, out, I think, because outside the window is dog poop. So, but I'm also in a bathroom, so it could just be poop. And we flushed that. I, I'm gonna get to testing some products. All right. You ever get bored while you poop? No, because you have a phone? Well, what if you forgot your phone? Also, do you, would you, do you, would it, do you want to, if, would you also like to improve your golf game while pooping? Well, then this product is for you. It's toilet golf. It's a golf club. Why you poop? Uh, I've seen this a lot. I can't believe I haven't bought it before. But it's a little golf course set up around your toilet. So you can practice your putt game while you poop. In. I was thinking there was gonna be a pun in there and there wasn't. Oh my goodness. This is something you give a dad for Christmas, right? <gasps> you got a do not disturb sign for your door. Golf game in progress. Okay, actually that is like the thing of it. I love that. All right, I'm gonna set this up and we'll uh, take a gander. All right, so I like you're pooping. Got your, your hole here, you got your balls. This green is very bumpy. Oh, too hard. I'll get it. I'll get it. Mmm! Nailed it. I mean, this is a hilarious, like, gag gift. And also, I feel like people might use it for realsies. Ah! I am so good at golf. Mainly the putt-putt stuff. It works. I don't think you could do it with the guy's toilet, though, because don't they, like, pee on the floor? I don't have much experience of sharing a bathroom with men, but from what I do know, don't they pee on the floor a lot? But also, I feel like I'd get very distracted while pooping and maybe get some hemorrhoids because I'd sit on the toilet for too long. But the product is what it says it is, and it does it. And then you did it, and you golfed while you pooped. All right. I would say it's a funny gag gift to the next product. Okay, next product. Now, does your bathroom not have the best decor in the world? Don't look at my shelves, they're messy. Does your bathroom not have the best decor in the world? Well, have no fear, because every time I typed in bathroom products, this artwork showed up. Shablu! It's a bunch of butts. I don't know why this exists, but it does and I'm gonna put it above my toilet. I think I was supposed to buy a frame and I didn't. I thought it came with a frame, but that was me just not looking into things and then purchasing things at random. So I feel like this could spruce up any bathroom. Um, you got all different types of butts and colors of butts and you know, they're all beautiful. Those ones look like boobs. Anyway, let's hang this up and see how it looks above my toilet. Well, I think that looks great. I absolutely love it and I wanna get a frame for it. It's just butts. It's just a bunch of butts. Ah, oh, I have crappy humor. <laughs> okay, next product. All right, next product. I've actually thought about getting these, this, it's just a one thing, for a while. It is a curved shower rod. So this right here is a straight shower rod. So there it is. So, but this apparently, and when, because it's curved, it'll give you more space in the shower because it's curved outward so the curtain will be pulled out a little bit i don't know if this is real or not so we're gonna take a tape measure and measure inside with it on the straight thing and then we'll do the curved one and measure and see how much extra room you're actually getting please hold right now with my normal shower rod and curtain here we go i have about 26 and a half inches of space from wall to curtain all right now let's put on the sh curved shower rod and see how much space we obtain i got a tension rod because i have i have the screw tile yep that's it and i cannot screw this into anything so i had to get a tension rod so i don't know how great it's gonna be okay i'm gonna read these instructions and get back to you it's up i put it up all right here we go Let's see how many inches I now have in my curtain. We were at 26 and a half, correct? Here we go. I now have 29 and a half. We gained three inches, everybody. Hold on, I wanna see how it feels in here. This feels so much bigger. Stop, get out, leave. <gasps> it is 
so much bigger in here. That is insane. Um, the only, I'm gonna tell you this, the only thing that really sucks about this model, there's a little thing right here to make it the tension rod longer or shorter, and these get caught on it. So that's the only thing about this brand. Also, you lose space in your bathroom because it comes out a little bit. So that's a personal preference for you if that's what you want. But if your shower is like super narrow, you can gain three inches really easy. I don't know why I feel the need to be like pressed up against this to talk to you. But yeah, you can gain room. That's actually a, pr that's actually a pretty good shower. That's, that's a pretty good bathroom prop. Yeah, yeah, that one's good, yeah. All right, all right, next product. Does that look weird now that that's just like out and about? I don't know. Anyway, next product. It's called the Magic Box. And you stick it in your shower and you can put your phone in the shower and then you can see your phone while you shower because we can't be without our phones for more than, you know, 30 seconds. So like, put your phone in it. Oh, you can still use your phone. You can still use your phone, ladies and gentlemen, if you like just really need to watch something. Okay, it's a little hard to use. There we go. There you go. So you can watch TV, you can't see it. Okay. So you can watch things while you're in the shower. I see. Okay, so you stick this to your shower wall. Stick this to your shower wall, like so, and then you can pop that on. And this is used for porn, isn't it? This is used so people can wash porn in the shower. Cause who is watching TV in the shower? Okay, we're gonna take this, there's an airplane, not a sexually explicit way and be like, you wanna watch while you're taking a bath. You wanna watch TV while you're taking a bath, all right? I, I don't wanna stick this on my wall. I don't wanna do it. Cause I'm never gonna watch TV in my shower. I'm not gonna do it. Okay, so just imagine that's there, shower happening. There you go. It is, I'm gonna say, it's very clunky, it's kind of hard to use. And I don't trust this to be a waterproof seal. I think water would get in that. It's not like, there's no like seal on it. It's just closes like a box. I don't trust this. All right, last product. It's little lights that you put on your ceiling or in your shower and it makes your shower colorful. Cause you know, sometimes it's nice to have like, you want your shower to be relaxing or whatever, you know? Nothing wrong with that. Okay, so it's remote controlled. Beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, we have an issue. If you've been around for multiple uh, bathroom or bathtub product videos, my, oh, my uh, tiles are textured. And nothing suction cups to them. So we're just gonna put this here. I'm just gonna stick it on the mirror and we'll see how it makes the room look. It's hard to do because it's daytime. <laughs> Hold on, you can see yourself. It, what happened? This. Do we not, do we not work anymore? Was this not working two seconds ago? Oh, it's cheap. Okay, the batteries undid themselves for a second. All right. Okay, this was not my vision. I was sticking to the bathtub, hold on. I can't test this because it's not dark. But it's supposed to be like you have two of those and you stick them on your ceilings or the top with the tile and it's completely dark in here and you just have the colored light and it make, you can make like your shower or your bath more soothing. But like, this, it's too bright in my bathroom and this isn't freaking bright enough. Okay, well, this isn't even that bright of a light, is it? Well, it has a remote control. So if you have a tiny dark bath and you can stick that to your walls, it could work. But for me, I can't get it to work. I'm very sad. Well, okay. Cue to the end of the video. All right, well, that's it. So we got a golf putter thing that was actually pretty cool. We got a painting of butts. Definitely in love with that. We got a shower curtain rod, which gives you three extra inches of space, but uh, the thing in the middle and this bump are kind of a hazardous. I just realized what I did wrong. If I flipped it over, that bump would be on the bottom, not the top. So then it wouldn't run into the thing. Yep, and then the other, yep, I have to flip it over. Don't, there's nothing wrong with this this rod. That's all me. I need to flip it and I didn't flip it. Anyway, um, and then the strobe light could work in theory and I don't trust this 
thing with my phone. And that's it, guys. That's everything we tested. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If there's ever any products you want me to test, please let me know about them. I'll get them and I'll test them. I love you guys so much. Subscribe to see videos every Tuesday and Thursday on this channel. Make sure you're checking out my podcast channel and my vlog channel. I love you all immensely. You're beautiful. You're wonderful. And goodbye. Cool,